Good early afternoon, everybody. <laughs> I'm home from work. I mean, that never happens. I still have to work, but I'm yeah. working the rest of the day from home, off my laptop, so I can be here for when the the, the couch gets delivered. Yay! So as of like 9 a.m. this morning, it left Orlando for out to delivery. So hopefully it'll be here soon. This is where we have everything ready for the couch. The table is usually over there, and it's gonna go there. But I just want to leave room for when. I want to try to get the couch into our sliding doors, and I'm going to go right here. Right and, we, Chick and we got some Chick-fil-A as a treat on the way home from work. Mm. Love me some Chick-fil-A. The, the box is here. Here's, here's the couch. Here's the really excited doggy that the UPS guy was just here. Um, I'm intrigued to see how yeah, it's going to look. I don't know how, like much construction. I've never had a couch come through the internet before. I feel like it's gonna be bigger than that, but I'm not I'm not quite sure. I'm gonna change. I kept my like work clothes on because I was nervous that the people would show up any minute and then I didn't know if it was gonna be like one UPS guy or two UPS guys or girls or if it would come built or not built. So I'm hot even though it feels like fallout a little bit for Florida. I'm gonna change. Alright, I'm back. See, I got Shorts on, a t-shirt. Oh, we no. did not show you. We had a travesty. <laughs> so you'll notice this basket here. We're using it as a weight on that blanket because Sarah fumbled her <laughs> Chick-fil-A barbecue sauce. Can you reenact what you did? <laughs> we should have just shown it. It dropped and I was like, I like what, I juggled it and it just flew. <laughs> and she kept bouncing it so it kept like splat, 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 splat. It was all over the wall, which is clean. So it's like But stain we'd remover. use like stain remover on the carpet, which is like soaking and getting pulled through that blanket. So I had to change my shirt too because it also had barbecue sauce all over. She is something. <laughs> you stop that. Yeah. Here you have it everybody, here's our new couch with our puppy on it. How do you like it Eve? Thumbs up? How do you like it Sarah? I like it, it'll take some getting used to. Like I thought like elements of it were going to be bigger. She thought the arms were going to be bigger. And then we have this now all, all set up over here with an angled chair with our lamp over there so we can actually use it as a lamp. Mm -hmm. And we brought the curio cabinet out from the second bedroom in here because we had the lamp and the chest over here. So now I got that there, moved that over. Here's a, a more wide angle of it. Here you are, sir. Thank you so much. Here it is are. officially Christmas time. <laughs> Peppermint oh. bark, Gear Deli. That is super good. Yeah. What are we doing? We're going to a resort, right? We're gonna go to a resort, and then we're gonna go see a movie. We're gonna go see Goodbye Christopher Robin. Is it goodbye? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. We're excited. One of our favorite actors is in it. I don't think yeah. we actually know the actor's name, but... Um, it's not, last name is an N. His first name is Tim. It's his name from my favorite movie, <laughs> About Time. But we're gonna go to Old Key West. We're gonna hang out there for a little bit. Take the boat over to Disney Springs to go to the AMC to see that movie. It's a beautiful night. It's 66 degrees out. It feels fabulous. That right there is a fun aspect of living here. We seek this kind of stuff all the time. Darth Vader and Doom Buggy. Look how beautiful this resort looks in the golden hour. It's so Floridian. I like the comment somebody left. Where did I put the picture? I think I put a picture on, I'll start putting a picture on Instagram of Epcot the other night. And I put it, I think, on Reddit or somewhere else. And somebody was like, no, nothing in Disney World is in comparison to Epcot at the Golden Hour. <laughs> it was like props. So we're just taking a little walk through 
old Key West before we head to Disney Springs, but look at that over there. We were up the green ones. That was our room up there. That light over there was our, first our bathroom or our kitchen. Really yeah. Our first vlogging. That was a magical trip. It was 10 days. Really? Six nights at Old Key West, four nights at um, Wilderness, Wilderness Lodge. Lodge. Nice. That's what we did after we kicked our butts working like dogs to get that, awesome. that trip. And it was the bomb. Yeah. So we vlogged it and now we live here. <laughs> Probably part of that trip is part of the reason why. Little piece of the pie of why we're here. This is like what feels so much like vacation to me because this is where I grew up coming. But we're gonna head into Olivia's to see if we can show you the picture of me when I'm really little. And look at this. Conflats Halloween Festival. So cool. We have until 8.30, so let's see what there is tonight. Oh, it starts Saturday. So nice though. They have these cute little balloons. It's a nice little touch of Halloween. Look at these desserts. Very impressive, old Key West. We highly recommend this bar. Oh, a cup of water. It's um it's considered a dive bar. Yeah. It's called Gurgling Suitcase. So fun. There's so much cool stuff in here. Oh, this hey, nice. yeah, how are you doing today? Good. You got my favorite bar here, do you know that? <laughs> oh yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Can we go? This is a complimentary storytelling experience along the Sassagula River. We encourage you to visit Community Hall to sign up and reserve your seat as space is limited. Saturday morning. Community Hall. <laughs> the legend of the Headless Horseman at Conch Flats. Have you seen pumpkins hiding throughout Old Key West? Keep your eyes open. Try to spot them before the Headless Horseman does. Scavenger hunt. Okay, so we're not gonna do the Headless Horseman scavenger hunt. But the water boat hayride? But we're, we're gonna. The first two to sign up. <laughs> for anything. 9 a.m., yes. Saturday morning. We're gonna be on this boat. Or this spooky story. <laughs> I can't wait. Well, that's so, like, whatever it is, it'll be cool, but we've been looking for Halloween stuff to do at the resorts. And it's like just walking up and looking it at the little signs. Think. Like, that whole sheet is just for Old Key West. It makes me wonder, like, how many resorts have their own slew of Halloween events? Because Christmas is overwhelmingly everywhere. All four parks, all the resorts. We were, when we were at the Grand Floridian, though, we did see that there was, there's, like, small events, but I'm sure it's just up to each, up to each place, resort. yeah. Yeah. And maybe because it's not as hoopla that, like, you wait until closer. Because all this stuff starts Saturday. Yeah. And Halloween is Tuesday? Yes. So again, Olivia's is just a little bit too busy for us to go and like see our photo up close. We're just gonna have to eat at Olivia's. Oh, we've never Maybe actually Saturday eaten morning, there. it won't be as busy because we're gonna be back here. We'll Please show it to you then. Gravy. Wait, were you saying just go see the picture or go eat? I was eat? just going to see the picture. I was. I hear the boats. I was thinking you wanted to go eat. You're leaving me, so it could be like a last supper. Sarah's leaving me on Thursday until Monday. That'd be the longest we've been apart from each other since, since 2000. 10? No. Yeah, since 2010. Seven years. We're lucky. Yeah. Edison, that's the inside of Edison with the lights on. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, so we came, we saw it on the boat, we came all the way over here because we were on the AMC to get our tickets. But I wanted to see, show you like the lights on in Edison. Look at that. They were super good about hiding the walls, like hiding everything with the walls, but from all the way back by Starbucks, you can see 
That light, that red light on top is on. There's posts right there for signage or neon maybe. There's lights on in there and right there, Trans Global Airways. What does that say? Your wings to worlds of wonder. All right, we're being trendy. We're gonna get one of these zombie frappuccinos and see how it goes. Yeah. It's a cooler. Oh, it's over there. Peter? Thank you. There it is. The almost $7 grande frappuccino. <laughs> The zombie frappuccino. It's apple flavors and got, I don't know, it's some kind of fruity brains on top. It looks like brains. Yeah, that's what it symbolizes. I think she's really gonna like it. I just took a sip. I think it's really up your alley. That. This is like, so I don't drink coffee, but usually at Starbucks at um, Halloween and Christmas, I get the caramel apple spice. Yeah. Like Try the, the dip your finger in the in the brains. What is that? Oh, look at this that we we didn't know this was here. I didn't realize it was Thanksgiving. Oh yeah. Look, it's the Coco family celebration. There was a sign over there for it. It's beautiful. And then they've got the band over here. All right, we're gonna try to do this tutorial really quick with that band playing in the background. But we're at Disney Springs at an AMC. We have our two MoviePass MasterCards. And what you do, you get your phone. You get your phone up. So there's two downsides that I've found to MoviePass that don't truly, really affect us as two people. You buy them together, you buy them separately, and you have to be at the movie theater, so you can't buy it ahead of time. So like, so, say if something was coming out tomorrow, it would be likely that there wasn't seats by the time we got here, you can't we got, You can come in the morning, and as long as you're within 100 yards of the, the place, they'll let you reserve it. So open up your app, go to Disney Springs, got your list of movie theaters, I'm gonna hit Disney Springs, and all of your options, all of your options pop up there. So go down to your movie, you click 10 p.m. So you, you check in and it says success. So what that did is it transferred the exact amount of money we need out of these. And now we can buy our tickets. So that's the, the downside. If you're going to like a premiere day, or last minute, there might not be anything available. So just do one to continue. We gotta pick our seat, so we're gonna pick here. Continue. See, it says a total 11.92. Put in, it'll tell you what zip code to put in. So then it'll pop the tickets out. So then I've used one card, I'm about to buy Sarah's now too. And there are our tickets. So this will be the third one we've seen this month? Yep. And we so paid 20 like, bucks yeah. to get the card. Had we gone to all three movies full price yes, here, we would have paid like 35 ish dollars. But each. No one's, yeah, each. Um, we only paid $10 each. So yeah, we're definitely getting our money. And we're, I think we're coming tomorrow night too to see that army movie. Yeah. Woo! Movie fanatics now. Christopher Yes. It is can almost. It's like seventy percent gone. Sixty. Yeah, there's most of Mickey Mouse. But look at this. This is it's so eerie. It's kind of eerie to see, isn't it? Yeah. I knew that they were gonna like repurpose the area and build that new thing. I thought they were gonna. Just redo a facade. What do you think? I wasn't sure. It's just so big. Like, it's just a big project, so. And we still gotta come here at least one more time before December 31st. <laughs> Hold on. Do it now. <laughs> You've never seen it. It's so good. You'll understand that little jig if you saw it. Then you're gonna hold the magical. 
Yeah. Cozy. This is very cozy. <laughs> Don't get comfy. Pretty awesome, right? Pretty swell. Pretty swell. Yeah. People always make fun of how it's a hammock. It's a hammock. It is literally alive at Disney Springs. There's a lot of people, but not too many. Yeah. But there's like a million bands out. Yeah. Like almost every restaurant, Love I feel it. like we walk past has a band. Like this guy's got a. This guy's playing the piano. Woo. Sarah got a skirt. I gotta get an outfit for the baby shower. Yeah. Instead of a good steak. Yes. So she's gotta look just the nine. Right? But you don't get to see it until the shower. Ooh, we're gonna have the shower. We're gonna have the shower in the vlog. Yeah. We gotta ask Christina, but be fine. don't see why not. Yeah. Um, right as I said, there's music everywhere. Look at this creepy drum, this creepy drum line. That's how you know I would not do well at Fortnite. Like that that creeped you out just now? Yeah. It's not a trip to Disney Springs without Girardellian Basin. Sarah had a good, good thought. I wanted to run in here and wash my hands, but she was like, why don't we get our Girardelli so if our fingers get sticky, we will wash our hands. Peppermint. I think I did peppermint last time. You gotta scrub them. If you've never done this, you need to come in here and try it because it's life changing when that water rinses your, your hands off. And I would do this like, I would try to do this like once a week. <laughs> I would do that once and I'd feel like I'd feel like a, a seal. <laughs> and then I'd, I'd slide down a wooden floor with soap on it. Can I smell? Ooh, Ooh orange vanilla. It's citrusy. The sleeves smell. Not used to sleeves. This one isn't as crunchy. And then my mom's come out the hit of Great job, Sarah got her entire outfit for her sister's baby shower. I'm so excited. So she comes up. I can't fierce. wait to wear fall clothes. Yes. She doesn't realize that she's wearing a denim jacket right now. <laughs> but but yes. But now we are not gonna be late for the movie, but we're gonna be late to the trailers. We love the trailers. And we I think we've said the past two times we've gone to the movies here. We like the trailers almost just as much as the actual movie, but because of going to Zara and because of watching the hula hooping skeleton. Um, that's what got us a little behind, but that's okay. Only in Disney World. Only in Disney World. Let's do this. There's my guy. It's 59 degrees out, <laughs> and we went from being cold in the in the I must said the hotel room, cold in the the movie theater, into being cold. At Disney Springs. You really liked the movie. Yes, it was, it was a big old drama. Yeah. We did say like there wasn't a, a big plot to it, but just like the story. The story of the of, family. So. Of the family of the author who wrote. There was not Winnie a mention Pooh. of Disney. Which yeah, cool. which is good because that was that a movie. free thing before when there was just yeah. those books. I don't think people realize that. that yeah, there was a lot of like not. hardship to. Like the family that wrote, from the, the author that wrote the, those books, it was a it was a struggle for them to be, for the their son who was actually just Robin to be a celebrity when he was just a little boy. It was really good, so check it out. So boats are done. 
So now we gotta go find a bus. And I don't even know, to be honest, I haven't even been to the new bus stop <laughs> since they started doing them, yeah, like, since they moved them. But clearly there's buses still going on because yeah. Raglan Road is still bumping. Oh. Wow. I feel like I'm on vacation. <laughs> The funny part is, is we gotta get up in three hours. So we're gonna try to get Sarah that, the iPhone 10X, quadruple, whatever you call it. We're gonna try to order that and it's 12.01 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, which even though it's just one more hour, like I felt like that's never affected us before. And now this is the second thing. Three hours. Three hours difference. So we have to be up at 3.01 a.m. to pre-order the phone to hopefully get it in like a week and a half or two weeks whenever it actually releases. Should we're, we just sign off now? Because we're yeah, gonna like crash we the second we get home. It's good to be home. <laughs> it's good to be home at, what the heck time is it? The next day. 12.30. <laughs> we know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.